What's going on Yu-Gi-Oh fans? Platinum Ricard is in the house and looks like we're to be getting some new support for an archetype I haven't even thought about for quite some time now. Super Heavy Samurai. This is kind of crazy. So first of all we got ourselves Super Heavy Samurai Bike. Level 2 Earth Machine Tuner Effect Monster with 800 attack, 1200 defense. You can only use the first effect of this card's name uh, once per turn. If you have no spells or traps in your graveyard, you can discard this card. Add one Super Sever uh, Heavy Samurai Monster from your deck to your hand, except... Wow, it's a searcher. I like this card. Already I like this card. I believe most of them revolve around having no spell or traps in your grave, so that's just how the archetype works, if I'm not mistaken, because it has been a while. But that's dope. The fact that it's a searcher, I like that. Secondly, once per turn, you can target one machine monster you control that has a level, increase its level by two. Considering a lot of these are synchros slash tuners, that's, I like the level manipulation there. So that's not bad at all. The searcher plus the level manipulation, I like that. Next, we got ourselves Super Heavy Samurai Spy. Interesting. Uh, level one earth machine monster, possible one for one target. Um, 200 attack and 700 defense. You can only special summon with the first effect of this card's name once per turn. You can only use the second effect of this card's name once per turn. If you have no spells slash traps in your graveyard, you can special summon this card from a free special summon. Nice. Secondly, if you have no spells or traps in your graveyard, quick effect, you can tribute this card, target one spell or trap in your opponent's graveyard, set it to your field, but banish it when it leaves the field. Plus the ability to snatch your opponent's spells and traps. That's pretty good, because there's a lot of generic stuff that is pretty useful. I'm not going to lie. So that's, I like that. That's pretty good. Next, um, Super Heavy Samurai Soul Gaia Booster. And it's a level 4 Earth Machine Monster, 0 attack, 0 defense, possible Piriri's map target. You can only use the second effect of this card's name once per turn. 1. You can target one Super Heavy Samurai Monster you control. Equip this card from your hand or field to it. It is treated as a tuner. Okay, that's not bad. Secondly, if you have no spells or traps in your graveyard, well, this card is equipped to a monster by its own effect. You can special summon. Okay, so another free special summon. So far, we have a searcher and two free special summons. I like where this is going. I'm not going to lie. Um, next, we got ourselves, okay, a Pendulum Monster plus a Pendulum Tuner. This is interesting. I, I kind of makes sense because there's no spells in this archetype or traps in this archetype. So I guess this is the next logical con 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 conclusion. I don't know why I couldn't say conclusion there. But I'm, I'm hoping that we'll see some extra deck support uh, right after this. Super Heavy Samurai Prodigy Wakaushi. Hopefully I said that correctly. Level 4 Dark Machine Pendulum Tuner Effect Monster. 1100 attack, 1500 defense. Pendulum skill of 8. Okay. Pendulum effect. You can only use the pendulum effect of this card's name once per turn. If you have no spells or traps in your graveyard, you can place one super heavy samurai pendulum monster from your deck in your pendulum zone, except this card, then special summon this card. Nice. This is also like a free searcher, essentially. Um, and then your monster effect here. Okay, so we're getting more than one, so that's nice. Uh, but your monster effect is, you can only use the first and second monster effect of this card's name once per turn. If you have no spells or traps in your graveyard, discard a monster, special summon one super heavy samurai monster from your hand or deck in defense. Uh, wow, that's essentially a deck searcher. You cannot special summon monsters for the rest of this turn except super heavy samurai monsters. Okay, but it locks you into super heavy samurai. I don't think it's going to be too bad, considering... At least for now, because I'm definitely going to be messing around with these cards by themselves as a super heavy samurai unit. Secondly, if this card is used as synchro material uh, and added to the extra deck face up, you can place it in your pendulum zone. Recyclability. Interesting. That is definitely an interesting card. Next, we got Super Heavy Samurai Monk Warrior Big Benke. Hopefully I said that correctly. A level 8 Earth Machine Pendulum Effect Monster. Okay. It's pretty high, uh, pretty high start. So, 1000 attack, 3500 defense, pendulum skill of 1. So the pendulum effect is you can use the pendulum effect of this card's name uh, this card's name once per turn. Uh, if you control a super heavy samurai monster, you can add one super heavy samurai soul monster from your deck to your hand. Okay, so searcher, super heavy samurai soul specific though. So it's obviously not going to be searching every single card in the archetype, but uh, a, a specific niche in it. So that's interesting. Um, next, monster effect. Oh, nice, a synchro monster. That's nice. Uh, you can only use the first and second monster effect of this card's name each once per turn. One, if you have no spells or traps in your graveyard, you can send one Super Heavy Samurai Benki from your hand or deck to the graveyard if you do special summon this card from your hand. Okay, that's nice. I don't remember Benki off the top of my head. Was this one that we've already seen? Let's see. Or is it an older one? It's possible it's an older one. Spy, bike. Um, yeah, it's possible the Benki one itself is an older one. So, uh, Super Heavy Samurai Big Benki is an older one. Um, or it's possible that it is, rather. So... That's just something I had the knowledge I don't have off the top of my head. 
Um, you can special summon this card from your hand. And then secondly, if this card is synchro, uh, use this synchro material and add it from the extra deck face up, you can place it in your pen. Okay, so that also has the ability to um, recycle itself. So that's nice. I like that. Okay, more than one synchro. That's nice. All right, so we got ourselves Super Heavy Samurai Overlord Masuru. Hopefully I said that. A level 12. Okay. Earth Machine. Synchro Effect Master. 2100 attack, 4000 defense. Nice. Um, one tuner plus one non-tuner mod. Okay, this is generic. That's nice. This card can attack while well in face of defense position. That's what I thought. Um, if it does, apply its defense for calculation. Secondly, if a super heavy samurai monster monsters you control will be destroyed by battle or card effect, you can destroy one super heavy samurai card you control instead. So a little bit of protection. Nice. Um, once per turn, if your opponent activates a spell slash trap card or effect, you can draw cards until you have three cards in your hand. Which, honestly, that's dope. Because of the fact that it's generic, um, I think this would this has possibility to see some play. However, it is level 12, so I don't know how easy it is to bring up, but I, it is a generic monster that basically gives you the ability to draw, especially in cards that are certain decks that make you like empty your entire hand. Like I'm playing, I'm messing around with the Dark World structure deck. Um, I definitely say sometimes that I run out of cards in my hand, so something like this could be useful, I'd say. Um, I just don't know how to incorporate it in that deck. In that uh, deck, obviously, I need a tuner of some sort. That's something to mess around with, of course. Um, but I kind of wish that there was like, I, I do like the fact that you can draw, but I kind of wish it had some sort of negation as well. That would be super dope. Uh, it's possible maybe the next one has it, and this one is a pendulum anchor monster, and this is gonna be the last card of the day. Super heavy samurai general Shanao, level eight dark machine synchro pendulum effect monster. 2500 or 2000 attack 2500 defense pendulum skill of one they can only use the pendulum effect of this card's name once per turn when an opponent's monster declares an attack you can special summon this card then you have no spell if you have no spells and traps in your graveyard change that opponent's monster's attack to zero also its effects are negated so one thing i always kind of wanted to mess around with this deck with is i know it it works at its peak when you have no spells or traps in your grave but i'm curious if you can mess around with something like maybe dimensional shifter or dimensional fisher or macrocosmos so basically all the spells and traps that you're using uh end up banished instead of in the grave so that i don't know how consistent that is because i, I haven't messed around with that myself but it, it's just something that i i just thought of right now so um probably just a wild idea who knows if that'll ever work but that's definitely something I'm going to mess around with. So for the monster effect, a uh, one tuner plus one non-tuner monsters. This card can attack while in face-up defense position. If it does, apply its defense for damage calculation. How much defense did it have again? 25. All right. Uh, once per turn, during the battle phase, if you control this synchro summon card, quick effect, you can special summon one super heavy samurai monster card from your graveyard or face up in your spell trap so then place this card. Okay, so... Monster reborn built in, um, plus also you do have the ability to bring out a pendulum, so I, I like that card. Um, overall though, I'd say I like this boss monster a little bit better, just because I'm, I'm, I really like the draw power, that's dope. I feel like this, I don't know in what sense it can be abused, because it is level 12, so I feel like it's harder to bring out, but I feel like Yu-Gi-Oh players are smart enough, definitely smarter than me, but they're, they're smart enough to where they can figure this out. I promise you sooner or later this will probably see some some play just because of the draw power but overall I think these cards are super dope the ability for all these cards this is searcher the special summons that we're getting off this stuff I think these are dope but you guys can let me know what you guys think about these cards in the comments down below this is plotter cards guys signing out for the day if you like what you see don't hesitate to like comment and subscribe and we will see you in the next video